Well, happy Saturday. This is Sherry from Style by Color. Today we are going to talk about color, the fall colors that you are going to be seeing this fall in the stores and some of them in the closet outfit planner. I'm not giving that away quite yet, but before we get into this video, I want to give you an exciting announcement that from September 3rd through the 5th, we are doing a three-day free fall fashion workshop. You all love our fall fashion workshops, our spring workshops, the challenges that we do. This is going to be a wardrobe workshop that is going to help you get fall kicked off in impeccable style. And we're even including two bonus days, but this will be the week of Labor Day, not starting on Monday, but starting on Tuesday. We're going to start at 7 p.m. We're going to go live 7 p.m. each night that week, three days in a row, and then we will have two bonus days. And we're just really excited about that. So make sure you register. You have to be registered, even though it's free, you have to be registered. So go to stylebycolor.com. You'll see a registration link right there. We also put it in the description below for you to register. Again, you can get the recordings if you're not in Facebook. Well, then we'll send you the recordings, but make sure you join us. All right, let's get started for the colors in what you're going to be seeing this fall. What I noticed is there are three main color stories happening, plus a neutral grouping. But let's go ahead and start with the colors first. The main thing that I'm seeing this season are shades of wine, burgundy, purples. So kind of let's put that into one category. I'm seeing blues, we're seeing electric blues, and we're seeing light blues. And we're seeing shades of green from autumn greens to soft teals and deep teals. So I'm going to go through and show you photos so we can talk about each one of those. Let me pull those up so I can actually see them too. Before I even get into that, let me tell you what Pantone, the Color Institute, says about these colors. They say that the colors this season are infused with richness and earthiness, and it they highlight our deeper connection to nature. Warm tones uh, derived from natural pigments, opulent mid-tones, accessible neutrals, and universal greens. Uh, they say they are elegant and practical. No must, no fuss is another word, term that they used. All right, so... Let's go ahead and take a look at the burgundy family first. Mold wine is uh, a color that we're going to see. We're seeing Italian plum. We are seeing shades of purple that are called uh, empress. Just gorgeous, gorgeous colors. But look at these outfits that I am showing right here on the screen. You can wear these colors from head to toe. You can mix them with your neutrals, whether it's camel or gray or even black. You'll notice there you're seeing a leather uh, burgundy skirt, which is uh, leather is still around. It was big last season. It's back again. You're also seeing here brighter shades of that kind of that uh, uh, uh Empress is kind of the color. It's sort of like a, a hot pink and a and a bright purple, kind of like they got married or something. But these shades really are stunning. Now, not everybody can wear the bright shades, but not everybody does well in the deep. You know, depending on your color code, if you haven't had a color analysis, what are you waiting for? Go to stylebycolor.com. We've got consultants all over the country and the world. We actually... I just trained one in Saudi Arabia. And so uh, I just think the, this family of color is really one of the prettiest, richest tones that we've had in a while for, uh, for our fall season. All right, now let's get into the greens. Obviously, olive green, I've got olive green on right here, is it, it's, it's a fall staple for many of your wardrobes, especially if you're warm or or deep. But look at how it's showing up this season, wearing it and pairing it with black, pairing it obviously with 
you know, mid-tone browns always looks terrific. But uh, think about taking one or two of the colors and mixing them together. I think burgundy and olive green would be stunning together. Obviously, olive green and the richness of the oranges that I have on always work. But take a look at the soft teals that I'm showing here and the dark teal. These are blends of color, almost like bringing emerald green into uh, into the, the 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 teal, and it just gives it some strength. I think it's it's absolutely stunning. I like this picture here where I have the soft teal and the dark teal being worn together, and then you're seeing that with a a gray skirt. But these uh, colors also look great with hot pink. You can take the teal and wear it with hot pink. I think what's exciting about the colors this season is that there's really some unique combinations that you can put together. So be on the lookout for these shades as you are out shopping and preparing your wardrobe for fall. We will be preparing your wardrobes for uh, for fall. So during that three day workshop. So well, it's really a five day workshop, but you know, bonus days, three day. We know you like three day, but sometimes we like to add on those bonuses. All right, now let's talk about blues. All right. So we're seeing bright, bold blues, electrifying blues, and very soft sky blues. And uh, it's odd though to have this light blue in the fall, isn't it? But when you pair it with maybe brown accessories or dark gray accessories, uh, it, it, it winterizes it. I love this light blue uh, coat here, wearing it with all black. Look at that, it's just a very sharp, sharp look. And then you can see we're moving into the neutral category. What is showing up this season? Shades of brown, shades of gray, and shades of, well, shades of black, black, right? But not shades of black, black. And you're gonna see some navy in there as well. but. I think the shades of brown this season are like yummy. They're luxurious. They are uh, just, I mean, colors that, oh, you just wanna like buy up the whole store with them. Well, I do anyway, because I'm a warm. But, but take the neutrals and mix them with softer shades of perhaps the tans, the, the, your whites, your ivories, or go ahead and mix them with another neutral. Put the tan with the black. Put the gray with the camel. You see what I mean? So really be thinking this season, what are we gonna do with color and how can you mix them in a more exciting way than just wearing one color head to toe and keeping it pretty solid. All right, who is joining me on the three-day workshop? Make sure you register for that. Again, it's free and we want to kick off the closet outfit planner with that, but we want to help you to get your style together. And you know, we always have amazing teachers and instructors. We bring on our team for that and I'll kick it off, but we're just going to have a wonderful week, September 3rd through the 5th, and I will see you over there. Bye.